everyone, welcome to the Border Collie Town channel dedicated to documenting the progress of our beloved Border Collie, Penny. I'm so excited to share with you my journey as a first-time dog owner and the experience I've had raising her. It's been a full year since we got her from the breeder, and in this first video, we'll be taking a look back at some of the top 5 things we did in her first 4 months with us that worked and didn't work. This channel is all about sharing tips, tricks, and our experiences with raising a Border Collie. Whether you're a seasoned dog owner or considering getting one of your own, we hope you'll find this channel informative and enjoyable. So, sit back, relax, and get ready to join us on this exciting journey with Penny. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more updates. Tip number one, active environment. Ensure that you have a backyard or a nearby park where your border collie can run and play. This breed requires a lot of space to burn off their energy, so make sure they have plenty of room to move. Tip number two, potty training. Border collies are smart dogs and can be easily potty trained with consistent training. As a first-time owner, make potty training your top priority. Take your pup outside at least every couple of hours for the first few months. If you catch them having an accident inside, bring them outside to show them where they should go. Tip number three, high-value treats. When training your pup, high-value treats are a great way to reinforce good behavior. Some treats that work well for border collies include boiled or dried chicken strips, cheese, air-dried pork liver, or small dog cookies with peanut butter. Just be cautious when choosing peanut butter, as some brands contain xylitol, which is toxic to dogs. Tip number four, consistency. Dogs thrive on routine and predictability, so make sure you're consistent with your commands, training, and rules. Use a firm but fair tone when correcting behavior and reward your pup consistently for good behavior. Drop it. Ensure that everyone in your family follows the same rules to avoid confusion for your pup. Tip number five, chew toys in a kennel. Border collies are curious and love to chew, so provide plenty of chew toys and consider getting a kennel for sleeping and resting. Place the kennel in a location where your pup can see you and be prepared for some whining and adjustment during the first few nights. Gradually reduce your presence as they become more comfortable and a kennel cover can help block out distractions for a good night's sleep. These are just a few of the key considerations for raising a border collie. Remember to invest time and patience in your pup and most importantly, have fun! In the coming videos, I'll be sharing updates on Penny's growth and what worked for us over the past year. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more exciting content.